So first off, welcome back to more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Uh, this has been an amazing game. I really like the way they got the setting down right. I mean, I was kind of worried at first when I saw some of the early footage, but I think overall the game has turned out great, and they've really polished it out to where the combat, the story, everything just really, really well done. So uh, you guys are amazing. You want more of this game quickly, you know what to do. Now let's get this, guys. I think I've already read this before. That's why it was already down, I guess. I hear a heaviness to your breathing, Hytham. Does your wound still trouble you? It does, I'm afraid. There is a pain in my chest for which I have no remedy. Rest easy, then. So long as your mind stays sharp, you will recover. Of course. Though I am reluctant to displease my mentor. You risk your health and your life to please Basim. That I do not understand. I should not expect you do. When we first arrived, I noted a shadow of suspicion in your eyes. A doubt. A wariness. Is that a question? No. Only an observation. We're about to go somewhere secret over here. To serve the lights. Are you well enough to steer this boat? I am. Have no worry. It is only prolonged stresses that exhaust me. My energy runs low rather quickly. Uh... <laughs> I think this boat needs to move out of the way. <laughs> Got a situation here. Hold on. Let me, uh... Let me move this one out of the way. There we go. Leave command. That's kind of funny. I didn't think it was actually going to come back to haunt me. Hold on. What am I doing? Well, I guess that also works. What? Yo, yo, yo. Hold on. Let me get on there. There we go. And what is this gift you wish to give me? It will not come from me. It is a gift you must give yourself. More riddles. Funny you are. Let me say it another way. My gift is not for giving or taking. It is a way of living. Still no clearer. It is a thing better demonstrated than described. Then I will wait. Forgive my jest. This gift we call a leap of faith. It is one of our Brotherhood's most sacred rites. It is not a tool we use against our enemies, but an act we embrace to strengthen our resolve. Like your meditation, it centers our minds. Steadies our hands and purges fear from our hearts and more practically it aids our movements in flight or in stealth You call it a leap and we're climbing a rather steep hill <laughs> There it is again the shadow of a doubt Nearly there our destination is there. I suspect you mean to throw me off this cliff. Is that it? Please tell me if I'm near the mark and spoil the surprise to perform the leap of faith, you must give yourself over to something greater. The gods? Yourself. Embrace the hope that death will not come before you are prepared to meet it. Believe this, and you will fear nothing. Our deaths are prefigured, weaved into the fabric of the world. To fear this would be a waste of worry and tears. Good. Then your mind is already attuned to my lesson. This is the same thing in uh, the other games, too, where you jump off and you land in, like, a hay barrel or something. <laughs> Not a barrel. A hay, hay bell. Is that what it's actually called? I don't even know. My mind tonight. Not it. But I hope this does get me some, like, because I... This is technically a side mission. All right, here we go. I will leap first. On my word, you must follow. Lean into your faith, into your strength, and take flight. You want me to jump from here? Yes. I would sooner grow wings and fly away. Thank you for the lesson, but... Wait! And watch! Hide him! Imagine if he dies. Hide him! Pig-headed fool! Are you injured? You see! <laughs> There we go! The classic. Ha! A perfect fall! And how did it feel? 
You spoke true. It was madness and vicar, a perching of fear. A gift I give myself. I see that now. Thank you for showing me the way. Of course. And thank you, Eivor, for hearing me out. You called this leap of faith a sacred rite. Do all hidden ones practice this same ritual? As far as I know, it is a rite of initiation that dates back to just before the birth of the Christian Jesus. Are you hoping to initiate me? I might try if I believed you would join, but that is not my purpose in England. Basim and I are hunting larger prey. The Order of Ancients. Yes. You remember the medallion you took from Kyotve's body? That is their symbol. They are a plague, one we hope to purge from this world. Like us, they act in secret. But their aim is to rule the world, not free it from unnatural fetters. The desire to rule is not unique to this order. Sigurd and I want the same, a land to call our own, and the honor that comes with it. Do not compare yourself to such people. The order has no honor, no principles, no humanity. Yet they sit on a great many of England's thrones. If you seek to pacify England for the safety of your clan... Then it may be in my interest to give you aid. I understand. You desire alliances. We seek to rid England of its deepening rot. Where these hopes meet, our cause does too. You may think this land ruled by harmless jarls and bumbling thames. Yet look more closely, and you will find a deeper threat. The Order's invisible hand touches all. It shapes everything, instilling its poison into every level of society. From the lowliest fishmonger to the richest merchants, from wealthy thanes to useless kings. Bassam has given me one task here. To locate and eliminate the Order of Ancients in England, in whatever dark corners they reside. If we work together towards this end, it will benefit us both. You will have greater influence over the kingdoms of England. And you will have more medallions to count. Exactly. You should begin in London. I have credible reports that the Order is working now to seize the city. I will speak with Randy about this. And while you are there, be on the lookout for our symbol. Centuries ago, the Hidden Ones had bureaus built around England. There were six, I believe. If you can find them, search them well for documents bearing the same symbol. It will greatly aid my studies. I will. Thank you, Hytham. For all of this. Alright, Order of the Ancients. Yo, was this a side thing? Because I swear this was a side mission. Uh, Secret Society of Pagans. Okay. Zeliots. Unveil and eliminate. Order hierarchy. Okay. So we got three. One. Okay. Yo, this is crazy. This game is going to be massive. So this is the entire tab. Order. Okay. Well, we need more clues. So we could just pick, like, this guy. And mark the target and take him down. But I'm not going to just yet. We got this guy some... I don't know what... Oh, that was that other guy. Oh, I remember that. Yo, nice. Okay. Not going to do that just yet. Breaking the order. Yeah, I'll, I'll wait on that one for a bit. I want to get back on track. That side mission was nice, but I also want to get back to this one. We got some skills, it looks like. Did we just get two points? Yeah, we did. Okay. Um. Well, let's get this. Brush of uh, brush with death. I'll push this to 20. Oh, the big... Okay, so the big icons give you two points, I think. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong. Um... What armor do I have right now? Because I might just go ahead and... Wait. Oh, I guess it's because I upgrade. I haven't... So it's, they're technically new. I got the Raven stuff on right now. Let me make sure. Raven, Raven. Yeah, I got all Raven stuff. So I guess as far as skills go, I could increase the one that's... Raven stats? Hold on. Way of the Bear. It's not that one. Where would it be at? Way of the wolf. Okay. What about this one? Here we go. I mean, the fact that I get all that, I'll I'll take it. And the good thing is I can reset these stats anytime I want to as well. 
fights. We got a long way to go. 3,000 away. We got different notes. Okay. Game's kind of opening up now. Uh, what should I do here? Should I... Hmm. Where am I at versus where am I going? We're going all the way up here. Okay. It looks like you can... We're going to hit up some fast travel points along the way. We got to synchronize those... But we gotta just follow the stream, it looks like. Up to that. Yeah. Alright, and we're actually, we'll pass a few of these, so I'll stop and... Not at each one, but at, at some of them I'll, I'll try to, you know, get all the synchronization points I can. For the later, uh... Later times, I'm actually gonna need them. Alright, here we go, here we go. I should have docked right there in front of me last time. <laughs> I just kinda went for it. We should be good. I guess I have to wait for the uh Yeah, we're going the right way. It I don't think we can open cell for a while because this river is kinda narrow. Unless that's not really what causes it. Here it goes, never mind. I was wrong. Yeah, whoever's on that little boat's about to get maxed out if they're not careful. Because I'm going super fast. <laughs> My guess is that beam of light? I don't know what those are. Mysteries, okay. Wealth of the other ones, and then... Artifacts are... I guess that looks white? I don't see any right now, though. So, yeah, you can stop and explore and, like, find everything you want. I want to just see if I can get to these synchronization points more than anything. This is going to be a raid, if I had to guess. I guess not. So, overall impressions of the game, I'm curious, since you guys, if you've watched up to this point, what do you think about this game compared to the last two Assassin's Creed games we've gotten? Uh, I think they did a good job with this, man. It's been really, really good. Gosh, should I go for that one or this? I feel like I should go for this one. Oh my god. Easy. Easy. Location discovered. It's probably going to give us XP as well, just for discovering stuff. 80 XP. I'll take it. Alright, let's leave command. Hold on. This could be a rough area. I don't know. I didn't even look at, like, if you need to be a certain level for this area. Let's see. I think we're good. Yo. So what are these things? Oh, a Zellion. I mean, should I fight him? Something. Oh, they are skull. That means I'm gonna die in like all oh, level 90. Are you kidding? That was a mistake. I'm out of here. Sorry about that. Oh my god. Time to go. Yeah. I don't know about this synchronization point, guys. At the end of the day, <laughs> was it worth it? Yeah, where is it? Where is it taking me? Because I marked it and it's like, I don't see the... Uh... Is that it right there? Yeah, that's it. Okay. Problem is, can I get there without... Without dying? <laughs> There's no people right here, so that's gets good. Alright. Breakable walls. I just want to get away from level 90 guy back there. Alright, because I'm really nervous that he's going to, like, one-shot me with an arrow right when I get to the top. This is something you'd probably shoot, I guess. If I had to guess. Wait. Am I crazy or is there like... I thought I had to jump over that. There's a glitch in the game, I guess. Alright, at least we put, we're, we're putting this on the map. It should give us a little bump in XP. I don't know how much you get for these, but... 
at least when I do get to level 90, I can come back here and actually try to take down this guy. Here we go. Here we go, baby. Yo, level 90, man. That's... I can't even imagine that. If you get... God, what is that? XP? Question mark? No? Alright. There it is. 250. Alright, we're gonna jump off Leap of Faith time. Here we go, guys. Good thing we learned that. Because I guess had you not learned that, you couldn't have, uh... You couldn't have done anything. I gotta get out of this area. This is a bad area to be in right now. Making a beeline back to the boats. Yo, I shot that guy once. Just kind of like a random pop shot. Just see, you know, just kind of test him out. And he just fell off the horse and was like, all right. I'm about to take you out the game real quick. This person's stuck. Oh, I actually made that. No way. All right, I don't know if I'll stop at the other ones. That kind of, that was kind of scary. Not gonna lie. But this should take us around the side. Let's see, we're going through here. Yeah, there's, I mean, there's a lot of stuff there, but I'm also, I'm not about to get killed and then get stuck here because you'll respawn next week. Yeah, we can, I'll get this one up here and then we'll just kind of, when I level up higher, I'll come back to these areas. But for now, there's just no way. There's just no way, man. Yo! Oh, that's nice that they actually do that. I was wondering. Okay, nice. Yeah, I don't even want to try to get that stuff up there. Like, I mean, I would like to, but at the same time... I'll, I'll come back to this side anyways. I got the fast travel point too, so... We are good to go. If I stop and get everything I see, I'll be here for days before I get to the next chapter or whatever. All right, so we got... We're gonna go straight up. We'll get here first. And then, yeah, that's... Oh, that's right up there. That looks so sick. We'll scale that, get that one, and then that way on the way back. We can continue later. On the way, on the way back, if we need to uh, make some stops, I'll do it, but... I kind of want to just get these unlocked just for future uh, traveling around. Because sometimes a boat might not be need needed. You know, you could just probably uh, skip around a bit. Granted, we've only scratched the surface of this game. I feel like... I feel like I can beat this game quickly, but at the same time, I don't want to. I kind of want to just take my time with it, and I don't want to, like, rush through it. Because I feel like this is a game that... Definitely, you have to, like, immerse yourself in. Alright, should I go for it? It's not too far away. Here goes, man. I wonder if, even if you come here, like... Imagine if this was, like, a level 90 area as well. I kind of wonder if, uh... Hold on, let me put my cloak on. Might help me a little bit. I don't know. Granted, if I run, they'll probably still look at me like I'm sus. So, I was in medical bay doing wires. There's no wires there, buddy. They pull a gun on you. Yeah, this is going to be nice. It's good to get these early on, though. Plus, it's 250 XP, and that's another reason I want to do it, because... Oh, it's a restricted area? Oh, man. I think I'm glad this game doesn't really quite have when climbing is the stamina bar. Because imagine getting halfway up the side of something like this and all of a sudden you, you can't... You, like, fall to your death because you didn't... Oh, yeah. That's, ooh, I don't want to try that. Well, we're getting a discovery for this as well. All right. So far, so good. Nice. All right. Woo! All right. Synchronization point complete. Hopefully, it's another 250. Because I could definitely use that XP. This game's going to be all about that. 
I kind of wonder how long they created this game for because are they making it? Like, is there something I can jump into down there? Oh, I see it right in front of me. That's kind of far out though. I guess it still it still works, so we're good. Dry bread, silver. Okay. All right. Next stop is uh, our objective. God, I'm surprised I haven't got to that footage I was sent yet. I just assumed... I like I called that a part one and everything because I, I assumed it was at the beginning of the game because you're like, your character didn't have anything. But maybe it was, but I don't know. What is this? It's more of that stuff. It's just like when I was in the snow area back early in like part one or two or something like that. All right, we're good. Wait, why can't I take command? There we go. Let me make sure this is facing the right way. It is. All right, we're good. There's another one to the left up here, but I don't think I'll go to that one. I mean, it's not quite necessary, I feel like. I bet it's all the way up there. Hold on. Yeah, it's pretty far out. I don't know if I want to go for that. It's right when I hit the corner, though. Maybe. I don't know. Think about how much XP you get just for... I don't know. Is it that thing way over in the distance? Oh, this is going to be like the corner at which it's going to be closest to. So I have to make a choice here. Do I want this right now or not? How far away is that, I wonder? Let's see. Five... 500? Uh, I don't want to get that right now. It's. I just want to keep going. It's a little out of the way, I feel. And it's next to the, like, the other side. And there's one coming up here, too. So, let's just... Let's go here. I think we'll be fine. Maybe on the way back if I even need to go there. Because I've got so many of these points unlocked now that it'll save me so much time down the road entire video is just me uh, me getting these synchronization points fast traveled unlock wait why do I have two things marked and getting a little confused here there we go <laughs> is it really a thousand away I felt like we were supposed to like maybe stop more I mean, we stopped twice already, but everything over here is just, like, so high level. Not sure what they really want you to do. Let's see what this says. Oh, no. Continue later. Hold on, let me, let me scan that. Does it not tell you, like, the power? There's no way I can do that. There's God's no way. Here, Pretty sure I'll get killed if I even try to go there. I could park across the street and shoot arrows at him. That'd be funny. Hush now. <laughs> Need your fate. All right. Yeah, I need to keep keep on moving, cause I'm pretty. I I don't know what happens if you die in this game. Like a, le, a legit getting killed. Cause I don't know when the last time I saved my game either. I'm hoping there's like checkpoints, but I'm not gonna hold my breath. We're getting close. I don't know if I should get out here or get a little further up. Oh, we got Discovery, so that's good. Ah, oh, let's keep going. Yeah, yeah. It's right next to the river. I've had a lot of fun playing this. Thank you guys so much for joining me each day. I've been grinding this game nonstop since I've uh, acquired it. I have this in Spider-Man early. I just, uh, I wanted to kind of, since I know I can't play Spider-Man yet or post it yet, I was going to kind of play this as much as I can and hopefully finish it before uh, Spider-Man. But we'll, we'll kind of see how it goes. I, I may not be able to. We're going to find out. All right, here we go, man. Save it. One thing I will do. I need your eyes, my friend. 
I mean, I just want to keep going. I gotta get on top of that building. Now, this kind of looks like something I've seen before. At least the name of the mission is. Repton. Secret should be here with the red. The sunset. Just in case. Doesn't seem like a bad area, so. Location discovered, alright. Let's climb this really quick, shall we? Man, climbing this game is so much fun, because you can just kind of go at your own pace. Wait, can I even... Okay, nice. I was a little bit worried. We're just going to get this point really quick. Uh, maybe not. I mean, you could not pay me to do this. Like, get all the way up here like that? Are you kidding me? There's no way. All right, another one in the books. At this point, I'm just kind of going with the flow of the game, not trying to rush through it. Like, doing stuff like this is fun. All right, where is it aiming me to... I mean, there's the... I don't know what to trust here. We have... I mean, I think the only one I can land is right... Oh, my God. Oh. We're good, we're good, we're good. I didn't want to try jumping off right there because that's, that's kind of low. I'm not going to lie. Had me a little bit worried there for a minute when I fell off for a second. <laughs> I was like, uh-oh. This is about to be bad. We got a person over here we can talk to. Maybe? Uh, let me, hold on, let me mark the actual quest, because right now I think I marked the other thing, and not the actual quest. Here we go. I think it's back, yeah, it's back over here. Follow the, uh, glowing, the glowing icon. Stands before Ivar Ragnarsson. Are you Sigurd Drenger? Uh, Igor! Eivor. If you keep that up, I'll stain the floors. The place could use some color. <laughs> Who are they? All spies. Dressed to look the part of a peasant. Got feisty. Pitchfork. From this rabid little one. Was a time when you met and slew your enemy on the field before they could dream of things like sending spies! And now we shake hands and make deals. Not my thing. I figured. I love them whipped, weeping, and... Reeking of piss. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Good boy. You're free, Saxon piggy. To run amok to the Mercian fields. <laughs> I would have let him down easy. Hmm. Follow me. I'll give you the tour. What do you call this place? I call it the shithole. To the Mercians, it is Reptar. Their most revered kings are buried below the church. Imagine they're weeping when we drove them out. You plunged your knife deep into the heart of this kingdom. 
That is right. We've got a number of Saxon nobles lined up with their lips puckered, ready to kiss our asses. The only holdout is King Burgred and his war thane, Leofrid. But my brother is brewing a plan to deal with them. I take it that's where we'll find my brother. Right. Talkers they are, Uba and Sigurd. Might want to dig the wax from your ears. Yeah, the name of this level, or not this level, but this mission we're doing, I think I've seen footage of it because I remember this guy being in it too. Don't play me for a fool, Abba. But I don't know what happens though. Sent a I'm not going anywhere, Backrut. You have the king on his heels because of me. Because of my men. For which you were paid. But that price does not change because you have caught a whiff of our hex silver horde. You forget I am a sellsword. I ask what I please, and I take what I'm owed. If I wanted to hear you talk shit, I'd gouge out your tongue and shove it up your ass. Now fuck off. Hacking over silver is a bad look for the son of Ragnar Lothbrok. But worry not, Uba. I have the warriors you need. If this is one of them, my worries have vanished. Eivor, wolf kissed. You have come at just the right time. Upa and Ivar here are hunting a king. And when we caught him, we mean to crown another. Our dear Thane Chelwolf here. It's not a role I begged for, but it's what Mercia needs just now. A man to fairly rule both Saxons and Danes. Are you fit to rule a kingdom? Viking rule uh, through a Saxon king. The current king will want your head. Okay. I'm going to ask. Hmm. Do you have what it takes to be king? One day, I hope. As it stands, we at least have an understanding. The king has refused our offers of peace. Jail Wolf means to change that. There'll be a new king for a new England. For now, Burgred is holed up in his fortress at Tamworth, making a final stand. Another shithole, only further south. We've held a siege there for weeks to no effect. So, no more knocking. Now we batter the gate to splinters. If we take Tamworth, remove Burgred and crown Shalewolf, come morning this Shire is ours. And Mercia soon after. Yes. Remove. I cannot stress that enough. Burgred is not to be harmed. My legitimacy as king hangs on this one simple fact. Uh, you rob all the joy from war, Saxon. Not every victory needs to be marked by the slaughter of a king. Ah, but it is much better. His request is fair, Ivar, and we will honor it. All right, can we trust? Uh, Sail Wolf's approach is smart. This is a sound plan. Let's begin. I'm going to ask this. Jail Wolf betrayed his present king. Maybe tomorrow he betrays us too. Why trust him? How can I answer that with any hope that you'd believe me? I only want what is best for the people of Mercia. And I want what's best for my son. In Burgred's Mercia, where Danes and Saxons murder one another daily, it's not possible. This is a good plan, brother. I am ready for the coming fight. Agreed. Yet remember this. Whatever you stand to gain here, so do we. An alliance between my clan and Mercia's crown. See this man installed on his throne and you will have it. I swear. The bold sons of Ragnar bellow to sound the spear din and the thunder of shields. So let fall the arrow storm. The battle begins. Ah, you never said this one was a poet. I need to piss. We have a forward camp just north of Tamworth. Will you go with us? Lead the way. Take in the sights of Repton if you like. We will be at the docks when you are ready to go. I'm glad you and your brother have come. If only to bring some measure of calm. Ease yourself, Cheowulf. We all stand to benefit. And you'll be remembered for this for years to come. For all the wrong reasons, I fear. 
All right, the Kingmaker's Saga. Nice. So we're going to this story arc, I guess, because we, we picked this area to go to. I wonder how the, So there's an entire another game you could do. I had a lot to see here. Hmm. So if I chose the other area, which I still can go there, I'm sure. Just not. Maybe I didn't go there first. I don't know. Anyways, that is it for now. I'm going to stop here and kind of take a break. Thank you guys so much for all the support. I don't know why I'm still trying to hide or whatever, but uh, you guys are amazing. Best audience ever. I've been kind of cranking out these videos fast for you. If you're enjoying this series each and every day, just keep it up. And uh, I will talk to you guys on the flip side. Take it easy, guys.